A group in Laurel gathers today to protest the FBI raid on former President Trump's Mar-a-Lago home. The raid took place Monday while the FBI was executing a search warrant for possible violations of the Espionage Act. The Department of Justice unsealed the search warrant and property receipt from the raid yesterday, and it shows 11 sets of classified documents were removed from Mar-a-Lago and marked as top secret slash SCI, one of the highest levels of classification. The raid has ignited a firestorm of criticism from Trump's closest supporters, including a group right here in Montana. MTN's David J. checked in on an event today where a small group of supporters decried the action, not of a former president removed moving classified documents, but of the FBI raiding his home. Nationwide, people on both sides of the political debate approve of the FBI raid, and there are some on both sides that disapprove. Here in Montana, some citizens came together in Laurel to express their concerns. They came from Yellowstone, Carbon, and Stillwater counties to meet in Laurel, motivated by the FBI raid at the former president's home. Our laws are just have, are, are being broken all the time, and so there isn't really truth and justice anymore. We care about our country. We still want to fight for our freedoms. We want to give people hope that, our, that we can still have a good country. Their um, heavy-handed um, raid on Mar-a-Lago, on the president's private residence, the way things are done in due process, this is, this is not the way it's handled. Lee Stevens is also running for city council in Red Lodge. We contacted his opponent in the upcoming November election, but have not yet heard back. Around the country, some say the FBI was justified in searching the Trump home, including Attorney General Merrick Garland. Copies of both the warrant and the FBI property receipt were provided on the day of the search to the former president's counsel, who was on site during the search. I will say, as a former prosecutor, but as a citizen of our nation, any attacks on law enforcement are completely uh, unacceptable. And some at the rally talked about the Constitution. The Fourth Amendment, illegal search and seizure, the Fourth Amendment was trampled on in the case of all those acts that were, that were carried out by the FBI and the DOJ, which is the umbrella organization of the FBI. The Attorney General says everything was done properly. Faithful adherence to the rule of law is the bedrock principle of the Justice Department and of our democracy. Upholding the rule of law means applying the law evenly, without fear or favor. In Laurel, David J. MTN News.